Okay, today I'm going to show you how to jailbreak basically any device using Black Rain jailbreak. Now, the only th catch to this is the iPod Touch third generation, which means if you bought it after uh, September 9th, I think, September 9th, 2009, should be a third generation. It's a tethered jailbreak, which isn't bad. That just means every time that you turn it all the way off, like hold it for three seconds and slide to power off, or it runs out of battery, to get it to boot back up, you just have to plug it back in and run this jailbreak again. And this jailbreak is extremely easy. Now just a few things before we do the jailbreak is you want to make sure that your iPod is updated to 3.1.2 firmware. You can check this by going to your settings, general, about, and then if you scroll down it will tell you your firmware. Um, if for some reason you're still at like 2.2.1 or you have to pay to up update, I will show you, I will put a link in the description to a place where you can download all the firmware and you just hold shift and click restore in iTunes. Like whenever you click on your iPod icon in the on the left side of it whenever it's plugged in you just hold shift and then click restore and you can pick what firmware you want to restore back to. And also if your iPod is jailbroken right now and you want to update it and jailbreak it again, don't just do the update do a whole restore to the new firmware because even though when you update it, it's supposed to delete all your jailbreak apps um, sometimes it still leaves some files and it kinda messes up but anyways first off if you go to blackrain.com and the um, I in rain is actually a one you can download it if you have Windows click there Mac click there it'll download and it'll be an icon like this and now what you're going to want to do is plug in your iPod to your computer and once it's plugged in all you have to do is if you open this up all you have to do is click make it rain and it'll do the jailbreak for you now I have a third generation and I turned it off so I've got to turn it back on and then I'll show you the jailbreak also uh, hold on just a second see if iTunes pops up if iTunes pops up anytime and says an iPod is in recovery mode, whatever, just exit it, exit out. It doesn't matter. Okay. Now to jailbreak it, just plug in your iPod. You don't have to put it in DFU mode or anything. Click Make It Rain. But okay. Now it's done with the jailbreak already. It you just have to wait for it to boot up a little bit. And it, it just says for it just says it's done basically donate. But anyways, while it's booting up, you should have this icon, just a picture of the guy with iPhones around him. That's the boot up screen. And just wait a little while. Once you get this to pop up, your iPod's basically jailbroken. And I know some it's scary to jailbreak your iPod because you're afraid it's going to break. But just wait. Give it a good five minutes before you freak out. And if anything, if for some reason it's not it just gets stuck somewhere hold the home and power button for like 20 seconds and your iPod should just reboot up to normal and if for some reason that doesn't work just run the jailbreak again and your iPod should always be fine it's never gonna break or anything it always has a DFU mode too which never fails okay so once it's jailbroken you can exit out of that and now on your home screen you should have this icon it's a little black raindrop, looks exactly like the desktop icon. Once you open up that, you should, if you're on iPod Touch, it'll probably just say Cydia and Rock. And if you have iPhone, it'll also say Snow. Now you can, um, this is just to download these to your iPod. If you want Cydia, you would click it and then a little install button comes up right here. You hit install. Do not install Cydia and Rock at the same time. Do not install more than just one th item at a time because um, that can it can mess up your iPod uh, is that's what people have been saying so just pick one install it if you want both pick Cydia install pick rock install or whatever and now if you're on iPhone and you want to um, unlock it all you do is pick snow and hit install and then once it's done reboot your iPhone and that's that's all you have to do and then it will be unlocked Okay, and just, if you're on iPod Touch 3rd generation, once you turn it all the way off or um, it runs out of battery, whenever you turn it on, the Apple boot logo will come up for a second, then it'll d say this. 
just plug it back into iTunes and run the jailbreak again and it boots up just fine. I have probably done this to my iPod 12 times. 12 to 15 times and so far it's never once not worked. I've never once had to run the jailbreak even again. So if you have any questions or something's wrong with your iPod, leave a message and I will try to help you. Okay.